Hi, it's Cynthia Morris. Welcome to today's Paris Wow. I thought I would do a studio visit and share the body of work that I've been making since I arrived in Paris. I did this a few days ago and had, had not posted it yet. And then there was already a bunch of new work to, that had been done, so I had to redo it. So let's start over here. I got into this mode of making portraits of people and I did a little series of my friends when we were hanging out having tea or coffee. And I also got into doing a series of peonies. They were just so stunning and incredible and I had to make several paintings of them including a couple of cards. There were a couple of illustrations that I did and some also in my journal. I really like these and I want to make more of them. Here on the studio desk are some of the pieces that are just kind of more experimental or things I'm not really super pleased with. I'm still working on these two. These are the stairwell in my apartment looking down. And then a couple of other experimental ones. I'm taking a class in sketchbook school and there's a teacher who does this kind of thing where there's just a ton of things on the page. And I, I kind of like how that turned out. It's very different than everything else, obviously. But um, and there's another card. Merci de respecter la quiétude. Quiétude, quiétude. I don't know how to pronounce that. Du voisinage. Thank you for respecting the quiet of the neighbors. I like that. Over here, we've got the paintings that I've done for my collectors. These were commissioned for me before I left. And these are pretty much done and ready to go. They're not all done. That last one on the end needs a little more work. And then a food series. Um, some of these might go to collectors as well. I'm not done painting the collector paintings. We've got about, we've got a baker's dozen of them, 13. So I have about five or six more to do. So I'm learning a lot in Paris while I'm working on these paintings and illustrations. I'm always wondering what's the difference between them. Painting seems to use a lot less, um, line and illustration is more line and perhaps some words. I don't know if really there's any point in me worrying about what's the difference between painting and illustration right now. I'm also working on value, um, making darker spaces in the paintings and light. Always the common things you're looking at when you're making paintings. So I'm really having a great time. There are three more weeks to go, lots more things to paint and work on. I had to go to the art supply store and buy more paper so I could make more paintings. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed this peek into my artist studio today and that this inspires you to get into your own studio. Thanks for watching.